Okay, I could really use some help here. Is this fire blight or is this lack of water? I'm noticing this on my apple tree here and some other trees. So you can see the curling leaves. They're at here, kind of at the top. Here they, this is happening again. I've had uh, apples dropping off, but I don't know if that's normal. I haven't sprayed the tree with anything. This is my three-in-one apple tree. We've got leaves curling here, uh, leaves curling up here. Some branches look perfectly fine, but uh, others, I guess maybe some decoloration here, uh, may, may have a problem. And if this is uh, blithe, I'd really like to know about it. So this is a bunch of blossoms there that Okay, so here's a here's a stem. It used to be healthy. You can see here it's all kind of shriveled up here. So I started doing some more deep watering. Watered it for a couple of hours, just kind of on a slow, very low, more than a drip, but a low run. Here's again all the way through here. So. What are your thoughts on this? Um, the branch looks, I mean, look at the difference to the branch here, and then gets up to here and it looks dry, it's all dried up. So, is that bl blithe or does it need more water or more nutrition or something? Again, here's, here's the branch, and then it turns dark. So that's the apple tree. Let's take a look at the uh, pear tree. Here I have three pears growing next to each other and what's happening here is that the tips of the leaves are turning black. And then I get a ring right here on the branch and that just snaps right off I and mean, just comes right off. And it's right below the branch that's infected. So here's another one here. Here's an affected leaf. And we've got a cut here, there's another one there, and it just comes right off. So is, uh, I've got kind of a curly leaf thing going on here, shriveled up. The tree in general looks really healthy, but I don't want like a cancer. This tree here looks perfectly fine. Uh, I don't want a cancer prop bothering with it. Here I've got a bunch of plums. A pear is coming on here on this tree. This tree's got a, you know, maybe a little curly leaf going on here. I don't see the black tips though. But you come over to this tree and we're getting the black here. There's some black spots on the leaves. But here again on the end completely black and it just kind of makes a ring and just, I'm going to pull these off because I don't think they're healthy. Again, another black leaf, a ring, just pops right off, just like that. Again, over here, too, just pops right off. So, is there something I need to do about this? It's been hot and humid. Here we've got a ring, you know, we've got uh, leaves that are infected, a ring. Another one, another ring. Just pop, pop them off. These come right off. Again here, same situation. So what are your thoughts? Uh, do I need to do something? Can I do something? Should I do something? Is this normal? Um, you're, if you've seen this before, if you've had this, I oh, hear some pears on this tree. I didn't know I had pears on here. Please, please uh, let me know. I'd appreciate it. And uh, let me know what I should do. Uh, just to give you a comparison, this is my pomegranate tree. I don't see any problems on that. Maybe blight is only for apples and pears primarily. I'm not seeing a drought problem, I don't think. Here's the navel orange. I got a little curling up of the leaves here. 
So maybe that indicates it needs some water, but I don't see any black leaves. Here's the avocado. Uh, it does look like we got some drying up leaves here. Uh, I did do some deep watering here also a couple days ago. But that, you know, this may be normal on an avocado. We've got a lot of good, healthy green growth here, but a lot of it's died back. I mean, this used to have a lot more green on it. Of course, it had all kinds of uh, buds. And uh, you can see I've got avocados coming on here. This is a one-year-old avocado bought from Master Gardeners last year at the, at the tree sale. So, any thoughts on this? If that's just normal, dried up, kind of dried up leaves there, or if it, in general this avocado looks healthy. Again, as comparison, this is a cherry tree I bought this year at the Master Gardener's sale. I don't see any particular concerns here at all. This is from last year. This is probably, this is definitely six feet tall. Leaves are a little bit more shriveled here. But I don't see the black, le black leaves. I haven't watered this tree at all this year. This is a three-in-one plum. I am seeing a little bit here on the black tips and black edges on the leaves. But uh, if that's all that goes, that I'm not concerned. It's not really deep green. Uh, so maybe I need to spray it with something or give it some nutrition. I haven't fertilized or sprayed these with anything ever. This is a two-year-old tree here. This had a lot of worms last year, but that was last year. So this actually looks fine other than the kind of the black tips here. Don't know what causes that. So any uh, input on these trees, uh, especially these leaves here uh, from, the, from the pear tree and, and my apple tree, I'd really appreciate it. Thank you very much.